This is GTV. I'm Ken Barry, and here's your top story of the day. Gary, Indiana, swears in its new mayor. And that I will faithfully. And that I will faithfully. And impartially. Impartially. And diligently. And diligently. Discharge the duties. Discharge the duties. Of the office of mayor of the city of Gary. Of, of the office of mayor of the city of Gary. According to the law. According to the law. And to the best of my ability. And to the best of my ability. The 21st mayor of the city of Gary, Indiana, was sworn in today in front of a packed house at the Genesis Convention Center. Mayor Jerome Prince, who takes the reins of the city on January 1st, let the residents of Gary know that his administration represents a new day for the city of Gary, Indiana. This is a really big day for all of us. It's a big day for me, certainly a big day for my family, but most of all, it's a new day for the citizens of Gary. During his speech, he laid out a vision for economic development, the marketing of Gary, Indiana, and working with local municipalities who have experienced success re-energizing their cities to learn how Gary can do the same. We've begun to establish a knowledgeable economic development team willing to cooperate with properly vetted, legitimate investors and entrepreneurs. And we will aggressively market this city with the Regional Development Authority to target enterprises compatible with our requirements and our goals. If cities like Hobart, Crown Point, Hammond, Merrillville, Cherville, Dyer, Lake Station, and even little bitty Whiting have found ways to revive and re-energize their cities, then why can't we? Please don't think I'm implying anything disparaging about those communities. In fact, I welcome their expertise, their wisdom, and my team will be directed and charged with the responsibility of communicating with them so that we may glean from their successes and we can build this city up again as well. Prince did the honors of swearing in Gary's new police and fire chiefs, Richard Ligon and Sean O'Donnell. Other newly elected officials sworn in today were 2nd District Councilman Cozy Weatherspoon, 6th District Councilperson Dwight Williams, 4th District Councilwoman Ty Atkins, and Judge Deidre Monroe. Thanks for watching GTV, Gary, Indiana, where it's always good news.